Hello everyone from all over the world and a warm welcome from our headquarters in Munich. Thank you for joining our digital world premiere of the new PowerShot series. My name is Felix, I'm the co-founder and CEO of Dimension. We are here in our warehouse where we have built a small studio to show you our new products. Today is our big day. The whole team at Dimension has been working towards this day for a very long time. And even though you cannot be here in person, we will do our best to provide you with the digital experience of our new machines so that um, you at least kind of have the feeling that you are here together with us. And today is not only about our new products, it's also about our view on what industrialization and automation in additive manufacturing will look like. Let me explain to you why we do what we do. Many people come to us and ask us if we want to develop low entry level solutions for industrial 3D printers. And we always have to say no, because we truly believe in the industrialization of 3D printing. Everyone who is in this industry knows that this is a dream that the whole industry has been chasing for decades. But this is a dream we absolutely believe in. Since the very beginning of Dimension, and today I believe in it more than ever. The time has come for 3D printing to enter the next era. And everyone knows that this won't work without post-processing. So we have done our homework and I'm very happy to show you today what we've been working on for the last five years. Today is all about our power shots. So it's about blasting. And we won't just show you one new machine, we will show you three new machines. And today is not only about the machines, but also about different processes. Now, to get some external input into this, I am more than happy to welcome Henrik from Prototal to our virtual stage to ask him, as one of our biggest customers, to share his experience with our power shots. Hello, Prototal, and hello, Henrik. Hi everybody, my name is Henrik Lundell, CSO at Prototal Industries with more than 20 years of experience in 3D printing. We've been users of equipment from Dimension for several years now and are currently running on a total of 11 systems divided between both PowerShot S and C for the blastering but also the coloring system DM60. It's obvious for us that the greatest benefits is increased efficiency, good repeatability and improved surface quality in these systems. All of these benefits are absolutely necessary when talking about AM as a production method and we really look forward to follow the future developments from Dimension that hopefully will make changes on the 3D printing arena. Have a nice day everybody, bye. So, now we are coming to the big question. How can we take the industry standard to a new level? Now, it's absolutely the time to start with the first product we will. Welcome to the world, the new generation of our classic PowerShot models, the new PowerShot C and the new PowerShot S. From the beginning stages of the development of our new PowerShot generation up until now, we always set our focus on features that provide a real customer benefit. We know that our PowerShots are real workhorses, therefore we wanted to keep them really straightforward and save the fancy stuff for another machine. As you can see, we maintained the split process between the machine used for the powdering, which is the PowerShot C, and the machine used for surfacing, which is the PowerShot S dedicating each machine to its specific purpose. But let's take a closer look at the new features. Our main focus lays on improving operator convenience. We are all used to operate our mobile phones and other devices in our daily life with a touch display. 
So in order to make operating the power shots as simple as possible and to improve the interaction between machine and operator, we added an HMI to the new generation, which is located at the top right side of the machine. Thanks to the HMI, in combination with several new sensors, the operator can now get feedback from the machine on the current operating conditions or status notifications. Moreover, it gives them more freedom regarding the creation and storage of individual processes, as well as the possibility to tailor the process specifically to their application. And the process is ultimately what it's all about. To increase process stability, we have been relying on ionizing units for quite some time, to prevent the buildup of static charges. Developing the new generation of our PowerShot C, we took the opportunity to boost the reduction of static charges on the parts and in the cabinet. The PowerShot C already got a similar upgrade uh, end of last year. We can now confidently say that we provide the best solution in the industry to get static charge under control, combined with the new air curtain above the PowerShot C's basket, the system provides a continuous cleaning of the process chamber to ensure residual free parts after the process is finished. Even though the focus of the power shots is on the automated depowdering and surface homogenization of 3D printed parts, it was important for us to retain the option of manual processing, allowing us to stay the benchmark in the industry in terms of flexible use. In order to keep the change between automatic and manual as simple as possible, we redesigned the safety guard so that it no longer has to be removed, but can simply slide up or down. Besides that, we upgraded all of the sensors of the machine to a higher safety standard and added bolting door locks to keep the door locked during an active process. As dust and powder emissions are always an important topic in the production facilities of our customers, the new generation will ensure that powder stays where it should be, inside the machine. As you can see, our main goal was to transfer customer feedback, feedback from the last years into beneficial upgrades for our cleaning and surfacing solutions. We are not yet finished. Until now, we have just shown you our new machines. But I also announced an update on the process side. And that's why I'm happy to welcome the guy to the stage who always has to deliver on the things that I am announcing. Welcome to my co-founder and CTO, Philip. Thanks, Felix. And thanks, Daniel, for the great deep dive into the new generation of our classic PowerShot C and S systems, which we are introducing today alongside the new PowerShot performance series. But before we show you those, I'm happy to announce that we have not only been working on new hardware, but also on a new depowdering process. Because the machine itself does not solve customer problems, we put such a big focus on the development of the right processes as well. And by combining the right machines with the right processes and both working hand in hand, we are talking about a solution. So looking at the complete post-processing workflow, there has always been this one process that was not yet optimized for 3D printed powder bed fusion parts, the depowdering. So today we are announcing the polyshot cleaning process. So today we are launching the last process that was still missing to complete the print to product workflow with perfectly designed and developed processes for 3D printed parts. It is the polyshot cleaning process. And this new cleaning process works with the new generation of power shots. It is enabled by a blasting media that was developed from ground up to perfectly match the requirements of depowdering 3D printed parts. A blasting medium in the right sh shape, the right size, the right weight and the right material combination to gently remove powder without damaging parts or leaving mineral dust on the surface. I can say the chain is now completed. And it's about time to get to the most exciting part of today, unveiling the new system. So as you can see, the best products in the segment just got even better. But we also promised to show you our solution for the highly industrial and high volume applications. And now it's time to unveil our baby that we've worked on so much over the last years. The internal development name was Colibri, which is the German word for hummingbird. Because a hummingbird can do things that no one else can do, and it is extremely efficient. 
The final product name is the PowerShot Performance Series, series which includes three variants, a PowerShot C performance, a PowerShot S performance, and a PowerShot Dual performance that combines both processes. And that's exactly what we're going to introduce now. Welcome to the world, our new PowerShot Dual performance. Such a relief, finally showing our new baby to the world. I know you all want to know more about the performance series. So now Julius, who is the brain behind this, will give you a technical deep dive into all the functions of the machine. I'm Julius, the product engineer, and I'm responsible for the development of our new PowerShot performance series. 3D printing means high flexibility, so we designed a machine that can handle this flexibility. We spoke with a lot of our customers to find out the daily challenges in post-processing and molded this feedback into our new performance series. Let's start with our feature show. The PowerShot Dual Performance combines the PolyShot cleaning and PolyShot surfacing process to reduce workspace and handling time. But the machine will be also available with single processes. The PowerShot C Performance and the PowerShot S Performance complete the performance series that enters the market as next level plastic system purpose, built for the factory of the future and high volume production. Let's have a closer look at the main feature of the machine. This is our fully customizable and quickly changeable multi-belt module. Why did we decide to develop the multi-belt? Because of the good opportunity to automize the loading and unloading. Also, this feature gives you maximum flexibility across several different application needs. To handle smaller batches, it will also be possible to separate the space into two smaller areas. To give you a sense of the loading capacity, we can process 1200 sample cubes or 30 shoe zolds or 500 i-class frames. For the integration of the machine into our customers' ERP and MES systems, we implemented the Siemens S7 PLC. We can provide state-of-the-art communication standards such as OPC UA or MQTT. It will also be possible to get quick help for troubleshooting via remote maintenance. We also integrated several sensors to ensure reproducibility. With these connectivity features, we can provide full traceability and maximum availability. With respect to the tight space of optimized modern industrial environments, we were not only able to cut the space in half due to the dual process, but we were also able to reduce the workspace compared to a classic power shot. The machine needs access from only two sides, which provides the ability to place the machine in a corner, for example. The HMI gives you access to configure all process relevant parameters, a wide range of manual setting options, and you get a detailed overview of the status of the machine. During the intensive exchange with our customers, we got a feedback that a hand plastic possibility is absolutely necessary in order to have maximum flexibility. So we decide to integrate this ergonomic optimized and quickly available hand plastic feature. This possibility gives you the freedom to quickly react to difficult applications. With our newly developed plastic media for polyshot cleaning, we can provide a new level of color quality and significant reduction of media consumption. This leads to less waste and less downtime. For maximum quality assurance and less media contact for users, we provide an intelligent solution to make sure to have the right plastic media with the right quality. To keep powder contact at a minimum, we implemented an integrated vacuum cleaner interface and the option to integrate the machine with a central suction. So, 
The PowerShot performance not only stands for maximum performance, it also provides maximum flexibility at the highest industrial level. With this platform, we enter a new chapter of industrial post-processing. Thanks, Julius, for your little feature show and also for showing us its capability in daily use. For the first time now, we have two quite different product lines that carry out the same processes but cover different application needs. When it comes to deciding which is the right system for you, the key question is, what applications do you serve and what are your own requirements as well as the requirements of the customers you serve. The classic PowerShot is the perfect entry system at the best price point. It is the first step in increasing quality and automating manual processes. This is key for serving high value applications and a first step in reducing costs in your production. The performance series on the other side comes with additional features making it industry 4.0 ready and paving the way towards the full industrialization of additive manufacturing. As you can see, we take industrialization very seriously. You cannot imagine how much effort we spend discussing each and every single function to make sure that we can provide the best solution for the additive manufacturing industry. Everything that you have seen so far is not a revolutionary change to our product portfolio. It's a consequent evolution that is necessary to come closer to our vision of the factory of the future. Let me please say thank you to some people because we are already at the end of our presentation. Thank you to our team at Dimension, especially our marketing team for setting up this great event and our engineering team for all the great things you are developing. Working with all of you is an everyday gift. Then of course, Thanks to our customers who gave us feedback in the very early stages and especially those customers who have given us their trust, trust since day one. And thank you to our development partners, our suppliers and our investors who trust in us and gave us the ability to spend a huge amount of money on this project. And last but not least, a big thank you to everyone who is in front of their screens right now.